A lot of children are very excited right now, gearing up for the fun of trick-or-treating. Bloomfield Main Street is hosting a big Halloween party on the square, and KTVO's Kate Alt is there. Kate? Thanks, Marlene. We're out here in Bloomfield on the Square. It's just a tad bit chilly out here, but not too bad. We're going to get some trick-and-treaters tonight, and I'm here with Janelle Putoff of Bloomfield Main Street. How are you doing this evening? Great. Thanks for coming out tonight. Absolutely, and you are all dressed up and ready to go. Tell me what's going on tonight uh, here in Bloomfield. Tonight is our annual trick-or-treat on the Square night. We've been doing this for at least 10 years. People um, just remember it's been going on for a long time, so um, we have at least uh, 40 of our local businesses involved, and they are just the best, you know, volunteers, contributors for all the kids in our community. So um, the kids are able to come out. It starts at 5.30. We're going to be grilling hot dogs here at the gazebo starting at 5. And then the kids can start trick-or-treating at 5.30 at all the businesses. And it goes from 5.30 to 7 tonight. This is your guys' busy season because you not only have this, but a couple of other events come up in the next couple weeks too, yes. right? We're really excited. Thanksgiving night, our beautiful courthouse will be lit. And that's a public event where we invite everyone to come out and sing carols and lights up. Uh, the courthouse, which is always exciting. And then December 6th and 7th, we have our holiday festival. And we have uh, a fun recipe walk that involves all of our businesses around the square. And then we're going to have great activities for the kids on Saturday the 7th, where there'll be a lot of fun, free activities. Um, so we invite everybody to come out for that. Good. All kinds of stuff going on here in Bloomfield. Like I said, it's just a tad bit chilly. It's just a tad bit rainy. But you can still come on out and come around trick-or-treating. we got a few guys down here in their costumes already. Can you tell me your name? Reagan. Reagan. And what are you dressed up as? Honeybee. Honeybee. How did you pick that costume? Um, because I saw it and I just think it was pretty. It was really pretty. It looks very cute on you. And what's your name? Rylan. Rylan. And what are you dressed up as? A kitty. A cat. Do you like cats? Is that how you picked your costume? Yeah. Well, you guys look great. You ready to get a bunch of candy tonight? Yeah. I hope so. All right. Well, make sure you come on out. We're going to be back here at 6 with more with Janelle and more with some of the trick-or-treaters. And Marlene, we'll go ahead and send it back to you. Treating. Bloomfield Main Street is hosting a big Halloween party on the square, and KTBO's Kate Alt joins us live from there right now. Kate. Thanks, John. We're back here in Bloomfield, and as you can see, we have tons of people out here today. No one is hiding away from the cold and the rain. Everyone is out here having a good time. We're here again with Janelle Put Up. What do you think of tonight's turnout? We're so excited. Everyone came out, so thankful that they came out to celebrate and um, celebrate the community and come out to the Bloomfield Square. All of our wonderful retailers have loaded up their stores with candy and invited all the kids to come in. So we're really happy with the turnout tonight. And if you're sitting at home, bring the kids. Come on out. It's not too late. We'll be here till 730. Definitely come on out. It's it's not even that cold out here, right, it's guys? All right. Fine. All right. Well, we got some trick-or-treaters down here. I'm going to ask you guys your names and what you're dressed as. Let's start over here with this little witch here. What's your name? Steph. And what are you dressed as? A witch. A witch. What did you pick a witch? Um, I just haven't done a witch in a long time. I like you got the whole green face going and everything. You're all out. What about you over here? What's your name? Maxwell. Maxwell. And what are you dressed as tonight? Mm, little turtle. Little ninja turtle. I gotcha. All right. Let's scooch on over here. And what is your name? Olivia. Olivia, what are you dressed up as? An Indian. Excellent. What's your favorite candy so far that you've gotten tonight? Reese's. Reese's. Excellent. You guys got lots of candy in there? Yeah. They definitely do. And we have one, uh, one surprise costume over here. This guy's uh, he's making quite an impression on in Bloomfield. Uh, what's your name? Dustin Miller. Dustin, and what are you dressed as this Halloween? Daisy Duke. Daisy Duke. Who talked you into this? All my coworkers were doing a contest at work. I hope you won. I hope so too. <laughs> <laughs> what do you win if you if you win the contest? Fifty dollars. Wow. Well, you have got you've got some courage in you to stick it out here. He's in his shorts, so if he can be out here trick or treating, you guys can. Too. You. you guys all look awesome. Thank you so much for coming out here. Thank you, Janelle, for having us out here. And again, you're out, we're out here until 730. So if you guys aren't out here yet, come on out and get some candy and join these guys. All right? We'll send it back to you, John. Thanks, Kate. Daisy Duke does have some nerve. Today, Village 7.